trying to walk to tell mom if you would <sighs> calm down. Okay? Take a chill pill. Oh. <laughs> there you go. Good morning, neighborhood community. Good morning. Oh my goodness. What is this? <laughs> Angels being silly. Yeah. So. So, I'm going to go with Dave today. And uh, we have to wash a mobile home. Fun. So, just part of uh, the both of us trying to get... Um, what are you digging? What are you doing back there? Is it freckles? It's freckles. What are you doing? Should I get the right shaver out shave you <sighs> all right what was I talking about you and Dave had to go and wash them yeah <laughs> and so um, we were looking at that as a possibility for uh, for business uh, uh, to me it just it's just another uh, handyman thing this doesn't look good come on boomer Angel, be nice. You too. Chill. I just got Angel calm. And uh, we talked about possibly, since we're in Southern California, of um, washing uh, solar panels. Anybody thought about that? So solar panels is something that should probably be washed on a regular basis. On a regular basis. I don't know how regular... Mm -hmm. But uh, I know that I bought, we have solar panels, and I bought stuff to wash them, but I never do. And they probably do need to be washed, and that would probably definitely help us with our yeah, electric bill. The cleaner they are, the more energy they're going to create. So, mm -hmm. how's that as a thought? It's just seeing both Dave and I up on the ladders, trying oh, to wash gosh. solar panels. Mm. But... Yeah, I need. We need to look into that and see if anybody's actually come up with that as an idea. Mhm. Mm so. Mhm. Mm Yuppers. So that's what's happening today. Val's yes. gonna hang out here with uh, all of these calm animals. Calm. Yeah, I've gotta get the air turned on here already because it's already hot in here. Calm. So, we'll talk to you guys later. Alrighty, bye! <sighs> Say hi, Dave. Hello. Turning out pretty well. We're getting better. Yeah, we're getting better at it. We're getting wet, but that's okay. It's like 100 degrees out here. So, as you saw, Dave and I went over to his mother's uh, uh, trailer and we, we washed the exterior. I think he's, she's getting it ready for sale. And um, I had grabbed one of the cameras, it was uh, the little red one that I like to take in the truck with me, and um, the battery was dead. So, that sucks. Because we had gone into Home Depot, I was going to film in there and the whole nine yards. And uh, so, and then I couldn't find my phone, so I usually will, if I forget something, you can always use your phone to videotape. And um, I found my phone, it was actually in my back pocket, which I never put it in my back pocket. Yeah. I think you're going senile. So I go, oh great. So we got to the, uh, um, mobile, the home. mobile home and I pulled the camera, uh, the phone out and it's got like 5% left on the battery. It just wasn't your luck today. So I managed to get a clip, a short clip that you've seen, but um, it's been one of those days. But it's it was gonna work. It's going to be a crazy day tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, you tomorrow is going to be fun. Yeah, I have two doctor's appointments. Um, hopefully they scheduled them close enough together where we won't have to come home and go back because it's hard enough getting me out of the house to begin with. Um, so hopefully, you know, yeah, 
One is an eye appointment, and one is my breast, your, my your cancer mammogram. breast. Your yeah. mammogram. I'm like your, months late on that, and yeah. they're not happy with me about that. Well, every time so. they try to do it, they something happens. Yeah, their machine is down, they're out of the office, they just closed, they took their last patient, so. Yada, yada, yada. Yeah, so this is an actual appointment, appointment. Um, so, yeah, um, gotta get up. Not too, too early. I think my first appointment's at 10.15 or something like that. Mm -hmm. So, and then um, my second one's at 12-something. So we might have some lunch in between them. If we have time, because, you know, and I don't even know what they're doing with my eyes, so. They're leaving them in your head, I hope. I hope so. <laughs> Who knows, maybe I'll be like the corpse bride and come pop it out. Got a little worm back there somewhere? <laughs> you yeah. never know. A, a mouth? <laughs> there might be something in there. A mouthy worm? <laughs> that explains a lot. Yes, <laughs> you'll never guess what we had to watch today. I don't know. House of a Thousand Corpses. I had to see Rufus and I had to see Sid Hayes. Oh, Captain Spaulding? Yeah, Sid Haig. Did yeah. I say it right? Mm -hmm. Captain Spaulding. You know, I gave them both kisses yesterday. I had to see them today. So we watched that today. Of course, Kirstie had to come and watch it with us. Well, she's yep. the one who owns it. Yeah, so. she owns that one. I have we, we all of them. <laughs> we don't have that one, so um, she brought hers over and we uh, watched that. So, and uh, she's getting ready to head over to the ranch to take care of the horsies. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to call it an evening. We hope you enjoyed a little bit of something that you may have seen in our video today. If you did, please give us a favorite. Please share our video with your family and friends. Please leave us a comment. But most of all, please subscribe. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Ta-ta for now. Goodbye. Jeez. Bye, guys! Bye.